Wow, it's such a beautiful day. Good morning. Why do I feel like there's some water in a muggy cup? Anyway, uh, happy Monday. I woke up late. I had planned to wake up at around 7 and go for my walk. I woke up at 8.40. <laughs> anyway, we have to do this walk. Honestly, since last week, I've been like, I want to go for the walk. I want to start doing the walk. I want to start. And starting is the main problem. So I have to start to do it today. I'll pass by somewhere. I need to take some pictures for a photo shoot we need to do with a friend of mine. Uh, I want to try and do like, I don't know. 7k steps i'm so sure i'll manage because the place i'm going is a bit far so i'm so sure i'll manage to do like 7k if i'm able to like do 10k every single day ah, you guys are not ready for my body by april you are not ready honestly right now i'm not so proud of how my body looks it doesn't look that good ah, it doesn't look that good so i need to get it back to work i am so lazy i am actually so lazy to get back to the gym because i'm not about to get so i really really hate gym pains ah imagine that i'm going to and i'm going to ah that is not about to be my life you know anyway guys let me wear my shoes then we start our work for the day <laughs> Honestly, walking in the morning is so so refreshing ah and the weather is so good today it's not that hot so it's easy to walk in the morning and the place i'm walking oh the nature is beautiful kicking feet up like a sensei juju hit my line like what you want babe this like is just the most beautiful place to take a walk in the morning can you see the nature the greenery it's also very silent and a bit scary because there are no people here but uh, i love how peaceful it is the only thing you can hear are birds doing my morning walk quite a lot and quite often because i'm loving this i am really really loving this Hey, shorty the school to my rock and I'm not talking about Jack Black. Hey, what you do when you doing something you not supposed to do. Thinking it's gonna shield the one you love like they bulletproof. Just like pop it, not lie when they know the truth. This felt so peaceful. I really, really wanted this and it was so calming. The place is silent. All you could hear was the buzz and the water. Just that I love, I love it. I'm having such a peaceful morning. Ah, I love this. This place is so peaceful and beautiful. I've stayed here for like 20 minutes, but now I need to go because we gotta work. I will definitely, definitely be making sure I come for my walks at least two times a week this way. This route because, oh my God, the nature in this place is so beautiful. Look at that. Finally, we are home. Honestly, that was such an amazing walk. I'm feeling beat, a little bit beat. I'm tired, kidogo, kidogo. But I really, really enjoyed that walk. The nature, the silence. It was like a nice meditating kind of walk. The river was so peaceful. I really, really loved that place. I'll make sure to go to that place twice a week. I walk towards that place twice a week. As I look for other beautiful places around this place I live. So now I want to go and take a shower, make some breakfast, sit down and edit. Because I like my videos for the week edited before Tuesday. Such that when Wednesday comes, I'm not stressed out like, ooh, I've not exported the video, blah, blah, blah. And also Friday's video is ready by Tuesday. It's, it's usually such an amazing space for me mentally. I don't know because I, I don't like the anxiety that comes like on Thursday I've not edited and I need the video up by Friday. No, I don't like that. 
that anxiety. So let me go inside, take a shower, make some breakfast, sit down and edit. I've just realized I've not had eggs for like a whole week. So for my brunch, I'm going to have eggs. I don't know if you guys add milk to your eggs. I always do. It tastes better. Uh, I'm going to add some thyme, some black pepper, some cayenne pepper, some coriander and some soy sauce. I'm going to have this with some bread. <laughs> I am currently watching Dynasty and oh my god, I'm so late to the party in Lonimianza season 1. I think I'm in episode 6 and wow, this series is bomb. Look at that fine guy, fine man, look at that suit. Guys. On this particular day, I was at my lowest. I've never felt this low like I felt on this particular day. It was a really, really tough week for me, honestly. But on this day, I just felt like everything now just crashed. Uh, for me, crying is not a therapy. I rarely cry when I'm sad or when I'm feeling low. I don't know. It's usually so hard for me. But on this day, I like, I broke down. Yani, I just cried so badly. And uh, I remember that evening, I was talking to this boy the other day. And he had told me about uh, this particular beautiful falls near our home. Because we are new here, I didn't know about them. So I just requested him to take me there because I really, really love nature. And nature is so calming for me. And I have learned to appreciate nature a lot. Like beautiful skies will make my day. Literally, I wake up and the skies are looking blue and white and beautiful. My day will be beautiful. And uh, this day, I just wanted something different something calming i wanted to go to a peaceful place place where there are no people i can't hear sounds of cars everything i can hear is the sounds of the waters and the birds and the wind like this was all i wanted that day and one thing i learned this day is that imagine it's okay to not be okay because for the longest time in my life, I always felt like I have to be a strong woman. I have to show like everything and pretend even when things are not working out. I have to pretend and be like everything is working out. Everything is good. Everything is good, you know. But on this particular day, I just learned, imagine it's okay to fail. It's okay for things not to work out. It's okay for you to cry. It's okay for you to feel sad. It's okay. And on this particular day, I was talking actually to my sister. And I, she told me, feel the pain. Connect with your soul. Because most times, I, I just assume the pain is not there. And on this day, like the pain was so bad. Came back home after the walk did a fine skincare listened to like an amazing music like amazing music and wow like that was a therapy that i needed and let me tell you by the time i was sleeping i was feeling so much better and waking up on that day i was feeling so good things were still not good but i was feeling better and i was at a mental space to think things out to think things like and plan now myself in a better way and my message to everyone is just be grateful imagine that a beautiful sky is something for you to be grateful about uh, waking up and having a sweet cup of coffee or some tea it's something beautiful to cheer up to cheer you up that day and it's okay to not feel okay don't kill yourself man the life is so hard learn to celebrate small wins that's one thing that i'm learning this year celebrating my small wins i go somewhere or i just create an outfit and it looks good or i just post something on instagram and the interaction is crazy and i love it uh, I'll, I'll i'll celebrate that small win because one thing i've learned life is difficult and uh, <sighs> difficult one day and the next day and the next day so just learn to find those small things that will always make you happy doing your skincare going for walks appreciating your small wins it's also a plus it's also a plus guys
one thing you need to remember is tough moments never last but tough people do thank you so much guys for watching this video please make sure to like share and subscribe i hope you guys enjoyed this. bye see you on my next one